Hello coin collectors out there. Welcome back to the DC Coin World channel. Here in this channel we're sharing with you some international coins. So today we're going to share with you some five cent coins from Singapore. What's interesting about these coins is that there's a little bit of a different variation to them. This one right here is known as the downward ribbon. As you can see the ribbon starts high then goes down. This one right here it starts low and then goes up. So this is the upwards ribbon and this is the downward ribbon. So two different variations right here. I thought that was pretty interesting. So I figured I'd share it with you. And let's talk about the two details of these two coins. One of them is dated 1995. One of them is dated 1989. And in this video, we'll talk about the years of mintage, the metal content, the value, uh, and the design that you see on both this side and the opposite side of the coin. So let's get right into it. We'll start with the one on the right, which is dated 1995. So this specific model in metal content was used from 1992 until 2002. Its value is five cents, which is abbreviated .05 SGD. That translates to about four cents United States dollars. Now, both of these have the same uh, value to them as far as the face value of the coin. This coin is a aluminum bronze metal. It weighs 1.56 grams. It's got a diameter of 16.75 millimeters and a thickness of 1.22. As far as the mintages of this coin goes, generally the mintage will help determine the value of the coin. If it can be worth more than face value, if it's rare, it might be. If it's not, it won't be. So this coin, there were actually 90 million of them produced. That is the highest year of mintage for this particular series. Uh, the highest by far. The previous year in 1994, I don't have those mintages, but 93, there were 5.9 million. So you can see it drastically increased from 1993 until 1995. Some other years of mintage, 1997, there were 60 million, then 31, 35, 32, 35, 33, 35, 38, 56 million. All right, so the actual design that you see right here, this is the front of the coin. It features the emblem of Singapore with the date underneath and Singapore on all four sides of the coin. Now, interestingly, Singapore is written in different languages going around the outside here. So at the very bottom, that is English. We also have Tamil, Chinese, and Malay. So those are the different languages that you see going around the outside of the coin. Now we zoom in right here. Well, this is, I guess, as close as we can get. Let me rotate the coin a little bit for you so you can see this one right here is actually in great shape. You can see, um, see it reflecting right into the light of the camera. If we flip it over. Here's the back of the coin. This uh, side of the coin is much less interesting. We just see the denomination of the coin, which is five cents. And then we've got these palm flowers palm flowers or leaves. So now let's get into the other one. So this one right here is the uh, downward facing ribbon. This one right here is the upward facing ribbon. The upward facing ribbon was made from 1995 until 1991. It's a aluminum bronze metal content just like the other one. Now the mintages of this, let's hop right into that point because the design characteristics are very much the same except for the direction of the ribbon in between them. So this one right here is dated 1989 and 1989. There are 69 million of these produced. It was produced from 85 until 91. 91, they were only made for collector sets. So that's not really a year that you should be counting um, as far as the highs and the low of the mintages goes. The lowest mintage would be 1985 in which there are 14.8 million of them made. All right, everyone, that's all the info I've got you for, for you for these uh, five Singapore coins. Again, these are the five cents. That's the uh, denomination used in Singapore. One of them has the ribbon going upwards. One of them has the ribbon going downwards. If you're into coin collecting, please do check out some of the other videos on this channel. If you've got any recommendations as far as videos you would like to see, specific coins that I should look to acquire and then make a video about, feel free to let me know in the comment section and I'll do my best to get that specific coin video made for you. Thank you very much everyone and best of luck coin collecting out there. Enjoy!